Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist man, the foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. Man, we back at it again with another episode of Pop the Balloon to Find Love. This episode 16, man, we're gonna do something different this time. I got my balloons too. I'm gonna pop my balloon too when we see who the people is. Um, don't judge me because my balloon pink. My daughter had a sleepover, and these are the balloons left, so. Y'all shut up. Don't judge me. But we finna get right into this, man. Y'all know how we do, man. We judging people. That's what we do over here. Look like they got dudes in there this time, so it's gonna be females. So we're gonna be popping on these females. See what they, you know. Y'all know how we do, man. Let's talk about some people. Here we go. Here's the pop, pop, pop. I ain't, I'm popping for all the dudes. Yeah. Address, I like that. We'll shake Alexandra Gildress. Come on, get to the bitches. To the females. What kind of shirt? I'm just saying the Ed Harder shirt. With a look. With a sword. What would it, what would it say? Cigarette smokers edition or something. I had them shoes he got on though. Oh my god. What has he got to pull up? These niggas cannot dress. Let's talk about it, man. He got Arizona sweet t shirt on. <laughs> well, look. That's my uncle. Ali and Anna. Right into it, so man. Perfect. We get right into the first what time we get into it. people didn't know was she was screaming for help. All right, you get your Hello, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. It's your All right, host, we'll see Arlette, the first female. and we are back with another episode right, of pop. pop the Balloon or Find Love. And this time around, we've got some single men lined up. Let me see. Make some noise, guys. I'm the single niggas. Boy, these some shirts they got on, boy. All right. So, the way this City is going to go, I'm going to be bringing out some single ladies one by one. Bring out the female. When she comes around this corner, if she's your type, you're feeling her, you know, whatever it is, or maybe the thing she says intrigues you, do not pop your balloon. However, if there's any I mean, I got a pink balloon, feeling, dude. Whether look, it's her hair, wow. outfit, or also, again, some things that she said, go ahead and pop your balloon, and then I'll go over to a few of you, see why you ended up popping. Come we on, ready? Okay, okay, okay. Well, look, they ain't got no All choices right, up so with that boy. being said, let's go ahead and bring out our first single lady. Uh -oh. We'll see. Who we working with? Hello, welcome in. I'll have you hold that. What's your name? Hi, my name is Jessica Carmen. Jessica, okay, and how old are you? I'm 27 years old. 27, mm. okay, and what do you do? I'm a doctor. I specialize in internal medicine. She, she ain't gonna pop your balloon okay, up there. Now, what are some things you like to do for fun? Who pop the balloon? Um, I like to do gymnastics. Um, I'm a gymnast, and okay, I also do cheerleading, little, too. Little I started back that. So, um, yeah, those are, like, the things I do. And I started a, a TikTok account, like, oh. a week ago. And okay. And also, <laughs> I post on YouTube. Hey, very it. nice. <laughs> so what are some things you look for in a man? Um, really, I'm looking for someone that knows what they want. Someone that came here with the intention of finding love and um, she a time, boy. also someone that's like, some ready shoulders to settle on down and has an end goal of getting that, married. Dirt off okay. your shoulders. You now, what are some of your get, deal breakers? That, that. Um, I guess somebody I who can't say someone that's unsure of what they want. If you're not ready to get married, like in the next few years, you're not really someone that I'm looking for. Okay. And yeah. Okay. <laughs> so we did get uh, a few pop balloons. Let's go mm -hmm. on over there and see why they ended up popping those balloons. Well, he got some childbearing hips. All right. Let's start right on over. The boy in the black. All black. We can have your name and age. Right here. My name is Johnny, and my age is 34. 35. And Johnny, what do you do? I'm a personal trainer. Okay. Oh, cool. he got sassy. So why did you end up popping your balloon? I pop my balloon. Because I don't really like girls. Because she's a doctor, for one. Oh. It's not a bad thing. It's just that you talk I smoke with a, a lot. And I know it's... You talk like a young a Shannon Sharp. Okay. Skill. And, yeah. It's, it's honest, probably not going to work. That's the only reason, for real. Like, you look good. 
Thank you. I appreciate um, it. You kind of sassy. So is the smoking a problem for you with you being a doctor? Yes. I don't really like cigarette smokers. But I don't really smoke cigarettes. It's other things, but, you know, not not cigarettes. But. Okay. So not is cigarette. Johnny someone that is your type? Yeah. I mean, you're a personal trainer. You look very fit. And so, yeah, I, I like that. <laughs> Thank you, John. Come on, What's man. going over to our I next think guy here? Sassy, Your man. name and age? I'm Justin. I'm 34. And Justin, what do you do? Well, I'm a CEO of a um, logistics company nationwide, semi truck cleaning and fleet company. Cool. And uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? Well, I mean, she's a very beautiful lady. Um, it just seemed like she was a little downspoken. She wasn't very confident when she walked she out. She is kind of meek. Um, I like outspoken people, you know straight to the point like hey what's up you, you know, like you're older 34 we got going so nothing you look like jar jar binks you seem like a very nice person i'm jar jar binks you know you're not loud enough for me you short too <laughs> man you be quiet yeah that's fair i mean honestly i'm like really nervous being here oh i could tell you know that's why i don't want to like use that against you but yeah. that's what it is for she right got some now, shoulders you know, on so. her you know mm -hmm. okay. that's fine but now, um is she, justin she shaped like a town boy justin is justin someone that's your type um uh, not really, just not really the type that I typically go for, but um, yeah, you're very handsome, mm -hmm. and yeah. When you say type then, and then you call me handsome, you mean like, in what way? What what, what kind of type? Um, I guess uh, maybe someone I mean, a like little more taller, but... Mm -hmm. you're like a know, better rapper. It's just my lot. preference, I yeah. guess. Okay, I got you, you know what I'm saying? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. All right, nice thank to meet you. you as well. Back. She a little bump back so there. we do still have some big a, feet. Uh, she's like a WNBA girl. Popped. Yeah. So what does she look like? Like she's from the WNBA. Ask these guys a question just to help us narrow it down for you. Okay. Um, does anyone have kids? Well, because we got. Our, look, I know light skin dudes got some kids. Like, look at all that stuff. Or, um, look yeah, how many kids? Look at them. Let's start over here. Okay, if we can start with your name and age. Hi, my name is Bassi. Um, I'm 36. I'm going to be 37 in four 30, days. So, yeah. 36 I do have two kids. I have an 11 year old son and a 12 year old daughter. But well, his shirt yeah. nasty. And sorry, Bassi, what do you do? I work in construction field. I do own my own construction business as well. So, yeah. You, he got the There's Brock Lesnar here. tattoo. Okay, on shirt. your name and age and what you do? Uh, my name is Kenneth. Um, Sharp. I, uh, I work for, I no work jumper. for a behavioral health company Church. for my mother and my stepfather. Yeah. Um, and um, I do have one kid, and uh, he's 10 years old. Oh, you didn't got tricked. He got tricked by somebody. He was with some dark skinned girl. You tell, that's all he dates dark skinned girls. He light skinned. Get out of here. I want to see this right here. Joker. But we ain't got time for that right now. we doing one this. More. Your name and age? Oh, my name is George. I'm 35. And George, what do you well, look, George, you got on a nasty worker. shirt, boy. How many kids do you have? I have two. I have two. You see them Africans, man? Nine and six. Them childbearing hips he got. All right. Um, honestly, I'm going to have to ask in? all of you guys that said yes to pop your balloon. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> so let's start here since we're here. So you why good, did you have your that balloon? that shirt ugly, man. Well, she looked beautiful. I was just curious to see what she had more to say about. Yeah. So. Now, apart from him having the kids, she, is she, she someone that no, is your she's straight. Yeah, okay. definitely. You said you're a healthcare worker? Yes, ma'am. She's yeah, not so approachable, though. that's really though. nice because... We have that in common. We do. Yeah. She likes you don't date. <laughs> yes, man. Outside, she lets you date white boys. Our next guy over here. Okay, so why did you have your balloon unpopped? Uh, well, she popped. She told me if 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 it's why are you have right, yours if unpopped. If you have kids, pop it. Yeah. So then, why did you have it unpopped okay, before so, she told you to pop? So, um, <laughs> initially, so when she came out, you know, Church. I, I found a physical attraction to her. Initially, I love long hair, uh, skin complexion, uh, seamless Those. shine, so teeth bright. That's what I like. So. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Ain't nothing wrong with it, but she's just, someone she that's just your type? boring. Oh, yeah, I would say so. Yeah, you're very attractive. Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, I would say you're my type for sure. And, yeah, I wish I got a chance to know more about you. Same so. <laughs> Thank you. Same right. so. And our last guy over here. So sure. why did you have your balloon unpopped? So when she first came out, I she noticed first that the, um, she was a little timid. She was shy a little bit. Her shirt um, ugly as hell. She has like a good personality about her. You got a so, um, with wings. very pretty. Um, I like what she's wearing. Oh, nice teeth as well. We so, yeah. movie. Yeah, Guardians no, of the Galaxy, yeah. that little thing that flew around. And now is he someone that's your type? And braids yeah, in the back look I nasty. I definitely say so. You like, also look very fit. Good try. Thank you. Yeah, very attractive. <laughs> Appreciate it. Though. Yeah, you look very stunning as well. Thank stunning. you. Stunning. <laughs> no, these ain't American right. men. We don't call so them So we stunning. do have four balloons left unpopped. 
I'm gonna go ahead and have you ask these guys another question. Okay, so I would like to know about why your last relationship ended and also if you've ever been married or engaged before, um, why it did not work out. Okay, all right, let's start. Right I would have had to pop my blue because I got kids. Yeah, so I forgot. Uh, my name is Josh. I'm 39 years old. I'm I wouldn't have popped my blue. And Josh, what do you do? I got a pop mental health therapist. Okay, and then just to go ahead and answer I got the question. Because she said, yeah. um, you got kids. Uh, so basically, so. Uh, we kind of outgrew <gasps> each other, right? So I feel like love wow. is basically I didn't want to make that, that noise. <laughs> love is freedom. So I allowed her to explore. Well, things popping in my so face, man. It's now crazy. So it's basically that. So I had to pop. So I got to get my next okay. balloon ready for the next day. next guy. You're I wouldn't pop mine for her. Philip, dude. and I'm 34. I'm 34. Philip, what do you do? I'm the assistant track coach for Arizona State. Okay. If you could just answer her question. So the reason why my last relationship ended is because the more I got on my purpose, the more our interests just changed over time. We're still cordial to this day, but we just decided to go our separate ways. Haven't been married, haven't been engaged. Okay. And have you ever cheated in a relationship before? No. Okay. He ain't going to tell right. you, did. That's my next balloon for the next one. All right. Your name and age? My name is Paul. I'm 39. And my name Paul, Paul, what do you do? Uh, ICU and vascular access nurse and property investor. Nice. And if you can just go ahead and answer her question. What do you bring? Um, so what my he last relationship, um, I don't drink very much, and you look like chronic. Of the something that she partook in. Um, to have some drinks at the restaurant, and drink alone at home, and that's just a little bit too much for me. A mean lizard. I rarely drink because I like to be in control of my body and stuff. Uh, I've never been married or divorced. What's that lizard and, uh, on? Never cheated. Um, very nice. Okay. We caught it. And so we did get a pop down Mario. here when you asked you like that Bowser. question. So That's let's what you head look on like. over there and see why he ended up popping. If we can start off with oh, your name. Lord. And oh, Lord. My name's Jay, 31. Okay. And Jay, what do you do? <laughs> I work for Fox and Recreation. What are those legs? Yeah. Okay. So uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? Nigga, skip. I'll be honest. Hi. You're nice. You're nice looking. Um, you look kind of sassy, know, I'm a private too. person. So when it comes to relationships. Is that a bowling shirt? I want to talk to you. Look at them pants. Look at them. Part look at those legs. Relationship, so. Look That's at fair. those yeah. legs. It's amazing. Okay. Boy, he got All some skinny right. legs. So is he someone man. that is your type, but you know. Yeah, <laughs> I would definitely say so. Tall, dark, and handsome. So How he built like that? I would say yeah, you're my type. Okay. And then so is she someone that is your type? I know that question is what made you pop, but is she someone? How you that get fat at the yeah. top? Yeah. Not a, yeah. yeah, wheelchair legs. Thank you. He been riding the wheelchair all his life, man. It's kind of scary when coming up. FBI. FBI. What the hell? What the hell? Right, see let's that. head on back. Get out here with your legs. So you out of go. these three guys left, I'm going to go ahead and have you pop one of their balloons, just kind of based off of what you've heard so far and, you know, go and get see the dude all that good stuff. So let me hand you a gray shirt. Get them up out of here. There you go. Yeah. And just go ahead and pop one of theirs. Okay. Mm-hmm. You know she coming for you. Oh, it's just these three. Just these three? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so why did we end up popping his? Yeah. Um, I guess when it comes to like immediate physical attraction, it just wasn't really there. Vanessa. But um, you're very handsome. You like b sure and rock steady with that shit in your head, you, boy. So. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> she's my type. I think okay. she's uh, she's great. I, I was the waiting to see down, more information because you know move doctors hair are off pretty busy shit, so with their you know. work-life balance, but it's fine. Okay. That little thing up there, it look, that's a lot okay, of them let's head on arm back. on their neck. Though. Guys, any questions for our girl? Your shirt ain't built right or something. Okay, right over here. So, um, what is the what is some of your characteristics of a healthy relationship? So, I think loyalty is very important. So shoulder pads? And also communication, like making sure you're communicating. Like, for example, if you can't text me because you're busy all day, like just telling me in the morning, like, oh, I'm, I'm not going to be able to text but I'll talk to you later, um, rather than just like, best, you know, dressed, ghosting me or like well ignoring my brothers messages. Right here the so I feel like communication, no loyalty, those are all very Them important. Them the two picks. Um, That's what obviously she's gonna not pick cheating, between. things like that. Um, and then also making time for each other. So like, I'm not someone like, I don't expect someone to take me on a date like every single week, like all the time. Like I understand. And then like, you know, there's free things that we can do. Like one of my dream dates is like a picnic and when, like in like the park or something and like i feel like you know that's something you could like buy twenty dollars worth of groceries at walmart and have it i don't need to Girl, be taken somewhere like, some fancy two restaurant. things twenty dollars at so, walmart yeah okay 
Thank you. Twenty dollars at the damn bit. So, with your profession, do you feel like you're going to be able to have a balance between work and your personal life? One hundred percent. So that's actually something like since I became a doctor, I just don't have time for people that say things like, "Oh, I don't have time for you," because I feel like I'm someone that makes time nice. for things that are important. The nicest to me. out of like them. Like I said, I do YouTube. I do gymnastics. He ain't got no hang stuff, time on his braids. Gymnastics so lessons braid it up. in my free time, and so I have that's you know, know like very is. little free time, but I feel mean that too. I can make time for someone that I really care about. Come on, man, pick one of these lame dudes and go. So I don't think of you. Okay. We tired of her. Okay. It's time to pop. <laughs> oh my God. This is hard. I bet. I bet. Yes. Oh my goodness. So you're 39. And how old are you? I'm 34. 34. How old are you? You're 26. Okay. Honestly, like, you are so attractive. Like, this pop um, is balloon. Yeah, you know. I can't say anything bad. You came dressed very nicely. Um, I just feel like if you may be a little too old because you're about to turn 40 soon. Mm -hmm. That's correct. Yeah. <laughs> and I feel like you're probably more ready to like be a little quick on things than I am. Like I would like to get married, but um, as far as like having kids, it's Come not on. something that I want to do like at <coughs> this moment. And you know, I, I just feel like you might be more ready to do something like that. I would pop mine if I was so, standing beside it. Like. I'm going to have to. Obviously, you had your balloon and pop for her for quite some time. Why so? Um, very attractive. Um, beautiful smile, and then why also, braids, I like that you have to why be disciplined. No hair on the side of the head like that. Braids. And then it's still within that discipline. You were able to. Uh, He's like a kickboxer you know, or something. Maintain your femininity. So. Your Thank femininity. you so much. Shut up. Who's smiling? This other nigga. That way and bring your balloon. He looking like this over here. All right. So my final question. Is it going to be a yes for you for her? Yes. Okay. Is it a yes for you man? for him? Yes. We got a match. <laughs> We're going with the big show. Take this mic, and okay. you guys can go right on yeah. over. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! You're good, girl. Don't worry about it. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Look at these uncles, man. That nigga little legs, man. He got to go. Little legs got to go. I want to tell you a little story. A few months back, my friend Woody Guthrie and I, we met a young man. I don't know, this sounds crazy. Two All men right, meet another man. Out our next single lady. Take the show for that, brother. All right, we'll see. We'll see. I'm going to pop my balloon on her off the gate. Let me see. In. What's your name? Hi, I'm Kiana. Kiana, how old are you? See. I'm 29. 29, and what do you do? Um, I'm a director of events and logistics. Um, I host events all over the valley, but I'm she like I'm dirty. mainly known for. A, I don't see nobody popping it balloon. I'm the best hair reader, of Phoenix. Uh, and they pop oh, off that. Sorry, um, best hair reader, of Phoenix. I also um, I am the. It executive depends what you're going there for. You going there for love? And no, I host. Um, I'm going there for classes, aerobics hey. and step classes she's with a, my girl Bianca. dirty though. And I model. Every and dress ain't gonna undirty you. Okay, very cool. So you do a lot. Yeah. <laughs> And now, uh, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, honesty, trust. Um, I, I feel like study, Hustler huh? has such like a bad connotation, but someone that, you know, can keep me going too. Like I really I want to state. be able to like be inspired. Mm -hmm. And so that's very important to me. Okay. Best, now I'm what are some of your deal state. breakers? My deal breakers are kids. I don't want any kids. Um, I would also you you. say... Probably, I mean, I'm a very understanding person, but for the most part, like, kids are one thing, mm. and then, um... Get out of here! Get out of here! If you've ever cheated in a relationship, that's probably, Shut like, up. another deal breaker for me, so... Okay, all right, so we did get, um, a few pop balloons. Let's head on over Ain't to the Ain't nobody left with light skin and dead, but... All right, let's start with Everybody your name and age. She looked dirty, uh, nobody wanted... My name is Josh, um, 39 years old. And Josh, why did you end up popping your balloon? So I popped my balloon because you said you were a tarot reader. Um, yeah, I'm really big on energies, and I think that me being a Christian, um, it kind of goes against my values Christian. and whatnot. Um, so I feel like within that, I'm, I'm going to have to pass. I completely respect that. I think it's important that I can be who I am and do what I do with my career. So thank you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. <laughs> and right, now, is out, uh, Josh someone that is your type? Absolutely. I think that you're very great looking and... Um, 
I, I love your style and you girl. seem very sweet. Yeah, she look like. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Let's go to our next guy over here. We can have your name and age. Hi, my name is Bassy. Um, I'm 36. Okay. And Bassy, why did you end up popping I'm your balloon? Bassy. Um, you, I like what you're wearing. You do look really good. Um, I like she, your energy. You look better. But you said you don't want guys with kids, so I do have two. So. Yeah. Thank That's you for your work. honesty. You're welcome. Yeah. Yeah. Tattoos only, okay, and apart from like them having kids, is he someone her. that is your type though? She'll yeah. Have um, I like I said, I would like to get to know you tattoos. more, but um, style wise, it's she'll you know have pieces for the first date. She'll have probably on not her. necessarily, but I still feel like you're really him, sweet him. and oh. it's it's really nothing personal. So so you prefer me to suit up and not? I'm Jordan's fake. You got on. So you prefer if I should suit up for the first date? Jordan's don't look real. I mean, honestly, kind of, yeah. yeah. They look like two different I'm Jordans sorry, put I mean, together. I won't be able to do that mm. on the first date. Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Sorry. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Let's go to our next guy. Metallic. Let's start with your name. I don't even make colors. It's baby food color. Okay, and Paul, why did you end up popping your balloon? Uh, she's got a lot going for her. Um, I only <laughs> work maybe two to three days a week. So, while I respect she's doing a lot of great things, she may not have the time. And uh, I like to just spontaneously be able tear to a card get on her up arm. and do stuff. So that's the only issue. But she really got no that, shape back there. She tall okay. and nice. Mm -hmm. and now is Paul someone that's your type? Kind of dirty. Um, I, I, I love how honest you are, and I love time, that you bro. like can uh, even night, thought about that. Like I appreciate daytime, that as far as like stink. style wise, and then height probably not. I do prefer just like a little taller. Sure. But you're really sweet, and I really appreciate you. No problem. Thank you. Let's go down over here. Okay, let's start with your name and age. Light skin dude is trying to get uh, somebody. Johnny, 34. 34. And Johnny, why'd you pop your balloon? Um, mainly because of the kid. I have a son and he's always going to be my top priority. Um, but the tarot reading, uh, I didn't really mind that because I do believe that that's a form of spirituality and, you know, that's important to me. But, um, Either way, regardless if it's a religion or just being spiritual, but um, more so the kid. But that did kind of like, kind of put a red flag on it. Like not even a red flag, just an alert. Like yeah. terror reading. I got to see what that's about. But mm -hmm. mainly the kid. But you're very beautiful. And, Thank you. you know, love the tattoos as well. <laughs> Thank you so much. All right. And now, is he someone that is your type? Um, yes. I, but like I said, the height thing is kind of important to me. Um, we, you know, I, mean, he I am wearing heels below, so and whatnot, but I do wear taller heels sometimes. So, but and then also the kid situation. But like, I, you put your kid first, and that's very important to me. So, thank you for being yeah. honest. Thank you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Our next guy over here. Your name and age, and why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm Justin. I'm 34. And specifically, the reason why I popped my balloon is because, um, well, she's definitely a beautiful lady. I like the tattoos, business owner, you know, fully operational and all that stuff, right? Unfortunately, I know her mother and her as well. <laughs> we are more of a homie vibe. Oh, okay. And uh, I'm just proud of everything she's doing, you know, so. Mad respect and good to see you. Yeah, oh my up? gosh. Wow. So, besides that, Say um, hey to my mom. it probably <laughs> would be a match. I feel like if I had like three inches taller where she, you know what I'm saying? But saying unfortunately, you know, things work out how it work out. So we good homies, you know? Okay. Yeah. okay, no problem. Let's go to our next guy then. Hey mom. <laughs> my name is Lucy and I have to figure out who I am. <gasps> Black. All right, we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm George. That's the girl I'm play them. And I popped my balloon because I got two kids. Just That's the only reason why. You're this very beautiful. this boy Thank looks. Thank you, George. George, somebody need to Thank fry you. him. We need a hood chick to fry him on that shirt. Apart from the kids. Is that like a golden grapevine? Um, not Is that necessarily. Some, a luchador and it's Latino mariachi shirt. Um, I love the style. I love Bullock. how sweet you are. Mm -hmm. The kids and. Probably the height is really the only thing, but aside Respect. from that, you need a cowboy hat to really wear that shirt. How sweet you are! Thank you. Very beautiful. Thank you. Yeah. Well, look, I can't believe you tried okay. it with that shit on, boy. So we do have two balloons left on pop. I got a go bear. He should like book me from good times. <laughs> so, do you have any questions to ask the guys to kind of help you narrow it down? See, this more yes. your type. Okay, go for it. Mm -hmm. uh, what are your zodiac signs? Okay, let's start over here with your name and age. Uh, my name is Kenneth. I just had a birthday, thirty-five. 
Happy birthday. I believe, I'm not too familiar on zodiac signs. I believe July is, means cancer, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so. Like early July, yeah. Okay, cancer. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Go down over here. You said she was ready. She kind of looked right. like um, your the, name and the girl age from, um, and what's your zodiac sign? Uh, my name is Jay. You said it not live. I'm a Gemini. Maya Rudolph. <gasps> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> just Look at him, boy. Boy. <laughs> just joking. I'm I love to do that to make everyone the feel legs. good because yeah. they are so Why he shaped like that, man? He shaped like a VCR okay, any other questions at the for top. The guys? He um, shaped like two sticks at the bottom. Where, where would you take my first date? He got the SpongeBob body. That brown um, shirt nasty. He look like he finna go bowling. That watch. I would take so you. Do you like seafood? I love seafood. I would probably <laughs> take you somewhere in seafood, most likely. Oh yeah. Uh, okay. These, uh, uh, one look, y'all ain't really got no choices. All right, where are you gonna take? I feel bad. That was all these cheap. Um, I would say I'm um, really interested in vegan food, so giving Tree Cafe. Well, look, okay. so I'm not they a get full these dudes vegan, from, but I think you know healthy I'm eating is the good dudes for the core and for the body. These dudes look corny, man. These dudes so, look lame. Yeah. Okay. Yes. I know the light skinned dude probably smoke. Guys, any questions for her? Prescription shades <laughs> and he got glasses. It's prescription. Okay. Um, do you feel like your family has a big influence on? who you date and and everything of that sort um i look like him to a certain extent i have two older brothers and i feel like they've definitely oh. set the bar and how My they respect their women ass. how they love for their women how they care for their women so to a certain extent yeah i mm -hmm. definitely would agree with that but not enough to like make me make any decisions okay. you know what i mean yeah definitely I have all sorts of shades that i wear all right, what's your question? So you seem like a busy lady. And then I'm on prescription. So do you have time to like get to know me um, as in a um, relationship? Um, yeah, I can always make time. Mm -hmm. And as yeah, long yeah. as that person's flexible with it's my schedule, because I'm really know how obsessed to with my career right yeah. now, then of course. Yeah. Yeah. OK. Let's go ahead and have you pop boring, man. Come on. I need to do something. Let me hand that over to you. So based off Is of what like you've seen, what you've heard, here? whose balloon are you popping? Okay, oh. so why did we end up popping it? He's too light-skinned. Um, I, I eat meat. I'm not oh. vegan at Yay. all. I love to eat like meat. I love food. I'm a foodie. So I... I he had me at seafood. Mm. <laughs> That's well, look, dude. <laughs> and so, why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? Um, first, I'm not I'm not completely vegan. Okay. Um, I just you like up, you know eating healthier food sometimes. She look uh, crazy, man. She look crazy. But I had my balloon unpopped because I was just curious on the Tauros readings, mm. and I wanted to know more about it. So that's okay. really it. Got it. All right, well, let's bring our guy on up here. Let's bring him up, bring him up, bring him up. <laughs> All right, guys. Got this, he got the Any 70s final legs. before we determine if this is a match? What do you do for work? I work in Parks and Recreation. Yeah, fat hour in the, in the kids' legs. That's really cool. Legs. Yeah. Na, 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 uh, let's see. Have a good time. Are you the youngest or the oldest? Look at him. Look at um, him. He don't want no woman, man. Look. The second youngest or third oldest? He had a nasty 2K build. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's see. We're trying to get out of a man. Take that girl. <laughs> you don't have any questions. Have any questions. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. Oh so God. then, is it going to be a yes for you for her? Yeah, it's a yes. Okay. Oh. Is it a yes for you for him? Yeah. We got oh my it. Oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. She I'll built take funny, this man. You guys can go right on up. Stocky. Let's make some noise for them, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like... <laughs> you gonna smash I'm not gonna let down. my dad come into down. my life and turn it upside down. Nope. You'll talk to someone. I'm trying to see no damn care. Watch the TV show. Got All it. right, let's go ahead and bring out our next right. single lady. Let's see the next one. See if I pop my balloon. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? My name is Jovenet. Jovenet, how old are you? 28. 28, and what do you do? I am a assistant community manager, and I'm also in the back. working on oh, a real no. estate license right now. Okay, all right, and now what are some things you like to do for fun? I like to gather my friends and family together. I like to, um, honestly, I like to turn on my music and okay. pour some wine and cook, um, just hang out at home nice. with my dog, and just, sometimes I like to go out, but it just depends you got a dog. on like where we're going, but yeah. All right, and now what are some things you look for in a man? I look for an honest man, a man that has a lot of patience. Mm -hmm. I ain't um, no patience one man. that is, you know, 
emotionally stable as well. Mm-hmm. I am emotionally um, stable. Someone friend. that is on a path to spirituality mm-hmm. with the most high. So nope, I, I ain't on no path. Yeah. Okay, got it. And now, what are some of your red flags? Like that you. Um, infidelity is a red flag. Mm -hmm. Infidelity, um, any domestic type of situation. So if you're not able to handle a conversation or have a mature conversation, don't do conversations at all. Mm -hmm. Um, That also has to tie in with the emotional (laughs) maturity as well. So those are like my main red flags. Also, someone who's not able to set a boundary for themselves and also respect boundaries as well. So. All right, yeah. cool. <laughs> so, as you see here, we have no pop balloons. Okay. So, what and that means, I'm going to go ahead and switch it on over to you. Okay. So, you for the first round, journey. I'm going to have you pop. Hmm, how many balloons should we do? Three. Let's do two balloons. Okay. I'm going to have you pop two balloons just based off of, you know, who doesn't really fall into your type or whatever it may be. So, let me hand you. Wing it down, this, hips McGee and down there, and the damn two, gold and I'll ask slogger you shirt. <laughs> Okay. Uh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Let me just join. Oh. Okay, and one more. Muscle head. All right. Little Stay man. Here. I like them shoes, little man. All right. Let's start with your name and age. I'm Justin, 34. Okay. And Justin, why did you have your balloon unpopped? Well, she's very well spoken. She seems like a lady who knows what she wants. Um, you know, I'm nah. approaching 35. I feel like I've done what I need to do as a young man, and I'm stepping into the next level. Mm-hmm. She seemed like she was up there at the next level. Young man, you, you Other than 35, that, nigga, ain't no young man about you. Okay, got it. Ooh. So why did we end up popping his balloon? Peanut butter it souffle, that's the name just of this weed right the there. the height. Um, Missing out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah um, it would just be the height for me, I would say, um, or just my, my physical type. For sure. Yes. Yeah. Okay. But you are very handsome. You're well dressed, though. I like well, yeah, that. I appreciate it. Well, you're yes. some ugly dude. I'm like man. the guy that you would call on the weekend. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let's go back over here. Yeah, your look, name I'm and the name. Other Paul, I'm 39. Okay. And Paul, why did you have your balloon unpopped? Um, just because it's well put together. I kind of saw the height thing coming. Paul Five built like them. Um, Spatials. Not really cutting it, I guess. Bowser. Okay. So he. He thinks height is the reason why. Is that why he's not honestly? Excited? To be honest, I had to pop a balloon. Honestly, okay. I had to pop a balloon. You guys all look great, so <laughs> no, they don't. I just had to pop a balloon. Okay, so, so. he is someone that is your type. Yeah, I would, I would definitely give it that a dude, try. Like, you you part know, of full I'm, force. I'm not Beside necessarily him. always about physical, With the, um, but ugly I had shirt. to pop a balloon. So, so my type, my <laughs> right. baby. All right, thank you. Don't like full force. All right, you know I'm gonna have man? you ask these guys a question just I'm to help cool. you narrow it down. Um, okay. How would you say that you tend to deal with conflict? Um, anytime that there's an issue, are you the type to walk away? Do you need a moment? Do you have to talk yeah, right then and there? Long. No, don't talk to what me. What would you say? Like, how do you how do you tend to deal with conflict? Okay. You going your way? I go your name and age, and the answer to your question. So my name is Josh. I'm 39. Um, how I deal with conflict is basically I'm slow to uh, res- uh, to respond. So. Um, matter of fact, I'm sorry, react. So I'd rather respond. You slow to respond right? too, much. So um, that's just how I deal with it. Okay. Um, Good. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay. Did she you want to add more? <laughs> um, what about you? How do you, you know? I like to take time also because I, I know myself. I know that I'm working on myself as well. So um, I definitely am the type of person who likes to take some time because I know we're going to come back. I'm the type of person that will always come back and talk about it. So. But yeah, if you could just respect what I'm trying to grow into, you know, as long as my person is there where I'm trying to grow and behavior traits that I'm trying to unlearn, that's exactly what I need. Okay. So if I needed some some time to gather my thoughts, are you the type to kind of like, you know, you need you need the answers now or you're going to give me if I say I need, um, you know, some space? Is that okay? Yeah, absolutely. If you're able to communicate, I need space because I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to let you know I need some space. I'm not just going to not talk or not say anything. But as long as you're able to let oh, me know, okay. I ain't, ain't going to talk to you. We can, it's, it's, we're, we're okay. okay. So. Me and my wife are going to go to my side of the bed. Okay. You with her side of the bed. All right, bed. let's go to our next talk. person here. In the same your name room. and age and the answer to your question. 24 right, hours. My name is Bassi. I'm right 36. Um, I do. I deal with conflict. Bassi. So most of what I boy. do is um, 
I don't usually get mad. I'm more like a, a fun player. I like to joke around a lot. So even it's very hard for me to get mad. So if I if I sh if I did get mad or whatever, oh, hey, what hey. I usually do for the most part is I just take a, a space, a little break, um, then what do do? Uh, think about the like, whole thing. Well, what's like I mean, what the what reason that? why we're mad about? So I, and I'll talk to what you about it, and, and I'll be like, you know what? Fuck up. Um, what did I do wrong? And I could be like, in there, man. I've been that bitch more balloon, balloon shit. Like, okay. Damn, good hot in here. I'm afraid you are forbidden from boarding without permission. My own ship. If there is something you need. What else that Shogun show? Our next guy, your name and age, and how do you deal with conflict? Uh, my name is Kenneth. Hey, doing the show for me. My age is 35. This is gonna be an hour some change. Conflict. Uh, if it goes hand in hand with like a disagreement, um, I would say. Um, disagreements should be handled. Like, you know, like, sharp. You know, it shouldn't you. be escalated. If two people care about each other right. and the so relationship is important, it shouldn't go that far. Right. You know, so if they value the relationship, it should be talked about. So it'd be de-escalated de de real quickly. Absolutely. So that's what I think. Okay, good. Okay. Name and age and how do you handle conflict? My name John, Johnny, age 34. Um, 34. He liked the I'm baby. growing. I used to I'm break growing. stuff. But I, um, boy. you know, as I get older, I learn that crazy? the best thing to do, if you can't handle or compose yourself, is to just kind of walk away until you kind of like, you know, can regain and you know, be in a mature space that you can talk about the situation. But like, um, I'm I'm still in the process of growing. But um, I think uh, just walking away from the situation and then just being like, we can talk about it later. Um, because right now I'm just at the agitated state. At the agitated state. Yeah. So just like you know, just knowing yourself, yeah. and you know. Yeah, the Arizona Thank sweet t-shirt. Yeah. All right. Our next guy. Your name and age, and how do you handle conflict? My name is George. I'm 35. I handle conflict by first taking my time. Um, I don't like to. You some feminine questions, man. Because you know, overreaction is the is the worst mm -hmm. reaction in my book. But uh, I, I like to them. take my. I put the speed on them, yeah. She popped okay, his, start yeah. By, I'm putting the speed not okay on them. It's okay for me. For you guys to have a successful relationship, um, i.e. a toxic trait. She looks a ditty. Mm. Okay, let's start down there. We always start with him. Let's give him some time. <laughs> All right, the answer to her question. My toxic trait is I tend to move fast. Um, I wear my heart on my sleeve. Um, I'm working on it, though. I'm working on, on being patient. That nigga head flat at the time. time, too. Okay. Yep. I appreciate that honesty. No problem. Okay. No problem. Let's go to our next guy over here. The answer to her question. Sorry, can you ask that question again? Because it seems like it was in two in one. What question. characteristic traits about yourself that okay. you've identified and noticed okay. that you can say be a toxic trait to your relationship? Philosophical mm, questions. Well, as for as me, you um, I joke around a lot in, in my relationship. And, I mean, I'm, up the dating but I'm good at Lord. that sometimes that could be like a defense mechanism his shirt is for me. exciting so i think uh, that might be like a little but i do know when to be serious though so yeah okay so yeah but i'm just very like i'm Ooh, not really like a um, confidential kind of a person but say to to us female and i'm not well, you like so come off as like dismissive no 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 no, 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 no i just joke around like a lot like this hasn't been um, this hasn't been having a conversation about Let's talk about a sport now. I'm the one that might tease you over that. So, yeah. I'm not, I swear I'm not, I ain't, I'm, ain't I'm ever seen the Jordans before. Okay. Yeah. okay, thank you. Yeah. All right, next guy. Yes. Uh, I mean, ain't no Jordan name, kind of sewer. So, like yeah. that, like you can like say your name again, but the answer to the question. <laughs> so, my name is Josh. I believe a toxic Jordan. trait that I have, um, possibly having just having some difficulty opening up. Um, so, that's like something I struggle with. So, I want to know more about you, but um, I'll you be trying to win. That. You know, people said that I have difficulty open up, so. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you. All right. You know what time it is. Pop. Time pop. to pop. Okay. How many? One. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm just gonna pop. Okay. All right, so why do we end up popping his balloon? Not that it would ever be an issue, but there, I'm, I'm a Pisces, so my entire life revolves around emotions, so sometimes it may be taken the wrong way if you're playing true? and I'm really serious. It may come off um, 
as a misunderstanding. And, and of course, in that heat of the moment, sometimes it can be a little bit difficult to understand that person where you're coming from. And mainly more so, it's just it, it's just going to be the the whole joking matter, like I guess. Is that peace? Most people like that. That's fine. Yeah. Thank okay. you very much. And so, why did you have people pops for her? Um. Oh. I'm just curious, trying to see um, what she's all about. And you do look good, by the way. So, yeah, yeah. Um, I like her, her energy, her flow, very she calm. She had a girdle so, yeah, on, and she looked yeah. good. Oh, thank you. All right, guys, any questions for her? We got one down here. <laughs> oh, man. Come on, man. Y'all boring, man. It is time. Um, I just wasn't feeling that initial connection. I'm so sorry. Now, why are you making him laugh that long? Like he think he had a chance. We know you weren't going to be it. Head on back. Uh. <laughs> All right. Let me bring you on up here. Come bring on, you on up get here. Go. So, I know you, you you thought hard for those questions. So I don't know if you have any final questions, but any final questions between either one of you? Right, because y'all bored me um, to death with that one. I don't have any final questions. No. Okay. So, is it a yes for you, for her? It's definitely yes. Ah. Is it a yes for you for him? It's a yes. We got a match! Okay. <laughs> I'll take this and you guys can go on up. <laughs> the rest of the girls ain't got nothing <laughs> to look forward to. Look at him. At PetSmart Kitchen, we're sharing helpful hacks to make your dog's mealtime extra special. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Good look. Let me see. I might even pop my Hello, boom. welcome in. What's your name? Oh, no. My name's Kendra. Kendra, how old are you? I'm 29. And what do you do? I work in sports. Um, I lead an athlete marketplace and help source NIL deals for athletes. Oh, Very okay. cool. Uh, what are some things I could do for fun? I Let love the gym. I'm really active. So uh, she has shape. Well, I shape also really love like. my dogs. I love <laughs> reading. <laughs> okay. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? <laughs> I love to see discipline. Um, she really too I villain, enjoy but. empathy, and I would say that seeing leadership in, like, I guess, like the females in match. leadership positions is not scary or intimidating. Mm, okay. Now, what are some deal breakers? Multiple baby mamas. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, I would say someone that isn't understanding or patient. Mm. That's another yeah. big one. Okay, cool. So no pop balloons. Oh, okay. Right when I said that, we got one. <laughs> Let's go over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. All right. My name is Bassie. I'm 30, 36. Um, you do look good, by the way. Um, the reason why I popped the balloon is because I don't, um, I don't feel, I don't see any chemistry. So yeah, that's just. Her shoes too big. Yeah, that's the reason why. Put her feet yeah. all oh, balled good, up though. for. Her. Oh, I like all your, your coordination. Mm -hmm. Thank yeah. you. Little sure. gnawed up feet. Got it. Okay. Now is uh, Bassie someone that's your type? She yeah, move her arm. We can see if she had breast or not. I appreciate it. Yeah. Her feet look balled up. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank you. So we do still have oh, uh, yeah. quite a few balloons left unpopped. I'm gonna go ahead and have you she ask these guys address. a question. Just help you narrow it down. See who's more of your she type. My first question is, what, she like what are you passionate about and what does passion look like to you? Okay, let's start right on over here. Your name and age and the answer to your question. My name is Paul, I'm 39. Uh, what I'm passionate about is helping people, uh, probably 22 years in helping people. Uh, what I see as passion is just somebody that follows their goals and does what they want to do and doesn't work for the check but works because they enjoy doing it. She's like, she's going to do you that. Like she's going to work all her and, damn life. You know, making things better. Yeah. Oh, she okay. no chance. Name and age and the answer to her question. Uh, my name is Kenneth. I'm 35. Um, oh, I'm she, passionate she about like she, uh, no watching my family grow. You know, from everybody in my family, seeing them oh, on another level, well, nobody, uh, they want that. being that's successful, just trying to leave struggling, now. and um, just happy where they're at. Y'all ain't gonna work. Name and age of the answer to question. Just, mm -hmm. My name is Johnny. Johnny, I'm 34. I'm uh, my biggest passion is uh, my career is fitness. Um, um, just overall health. Um, she shaped like fitness. Jordan Grace. She and, shaped um, like a, also my a TNA well, Women's Champion. Well, Knockout fitness champion. is my biggest passion in terms so of her uh, upper body look. Like my Not element. all the muscle, just the. Name and age, and the answer to her question. I'm Justin. I'm 34. 
So I got three answers. Uh, the first of which is family. I love my family. We have a very large family. I have brothers, sisters, nephews, uncles, nieces, nephews. We all close. I'm from the Midwest. Uh, secondly is definitely business uh, because I didn't come from a background of business and I developed myself in that aspect, um, which allows me to take care of my family, which I love so much. So uh, that's second. And then thirdly, um, I have ADD, so I kind of like ran off with that third part of the question. Just running back real quick. <laughs> yeah. Um, what does passion look like to passion. you? Passion. There we go. Okay. So passion is, for me, being passionate about being passionate about something. Well, look, um, man. Being a business owner, I'm an athlete, uh, I have family. I All those things I'm very passionate about. Hey. Ooh, that New Zippo, the only bag with the it's easy guide seal, designed to, to keep it. your we kids' lunch secure. We have to the whole ad now. You see? There's nothing more powerful than you making your thing happen. Re oh, the Come long on. session. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and have you ask these guys another. Oh, wait, actually, I'm going to have you pop two balloons. Two balloons. Since Let's we've see. heard quite a few from them, let me give you a pick. Go ahead and pop those two. Light skin dude look like a slimy, busy bone. Go and get Hips McGee out of here. Okay, and then one more. Oh! Go and get him right off. Okay, bow, bow. let's let's start right over here. So he did get his balloon back. Why do we end up popping his? I think just further reflecting on the answer, I want someone that's going to see value in who I am as a person, what mm -hmm. I provide. Um, obviously, with my job, I'm very passionate about. I empower athletes that are from like every kind of background. So I think that I'm gonna need someone who's a little bit less worried about like the little things like nails and right. someone that's worried about in my opinion like things that are valuable 100%. to me like yeah i understand that, that i do have a rebuttal nope 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 nope, nope. <laughs> let's move on over here why did we end up popping his i think for me it wasn't that you had a bad answer it just wasn't one that was more compatible with what i was looking for it's the as shirt well as man physical it's connection. the shirt so Respect, respect. And he got like a half of a button up cool. with another shirt underneath it. It's black. All right. My boy musty we up there. We have three man. balloons be. left unpopped. Go ahead and ask these guys another question to help us narrow it down. I would love to know how your friends describe you. Um, something good and then something maybe more negative. This show lost the damn plot okay. or something, man. Start with the people here. they're picking. This is this one of the um, fall off episodes start with right your name here. And age. Paul, my name. My name is Paul. I'm 39 years old. This ain't moving uh, the good me, things man. they would probably say is... this alone. I know, come on up. That's what she picked, light skin. Okay, let's see. All right, guys. We'll you said that's all your questions. I like Any them shoes you got on, end? though. I ain't gonna front. I have to do this. I'm sorry. Okay, why did we end up hopping? Just not a strong connection. Mm -hmm. um, you look yeah. grimy. Look at him. Okay. Yeah. Got it. She well, got them all the way up there. <laughs> well, that is all the balloons yeah. popped, That's but it. thank you so much for coming That's on. Let's it. go ahead and give it up for her, guys. Take this one. Thank you. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single <gasps> lady. Hello, welcome in. What's oh, your name? No. Brisa. Brisa. Oh. Mm -hmm. How old are you? Uh, 29. 29, and what do you do? I'm a legal specialist. Okay, nice. Uh, what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, I go kayaking and I do yoga and Lyra. Nice. And what are some things you look for in a man? Um, someone who's genuine, who's able to have really good banter with me. She's a witch. Funny. Do you see her um, feet touch the ground? She came there. Nice. And now, what are some of your deal breakers? Um, smoking of any kind wow. and excessive alcohol use but wow um, good god okay cool. so we did get a few pop balloons <laughs> let's head on over there and see why they ended up popping let's start right over here all right let's start with your name and age pop. and yeah, pop. popping your balloon my name is paul i'm 39 years old and so i want to be very well put together my, my pot smoking uh, a little shy mm. i mainly popped the balloon because while you're very pretty um i just like somebody a little bit more edgy um, she is in, she know, in the golf world. Cute the golf sexy, world, just she, like more in she the middle, a star. She's very innocent and well put together. Okay. Yeah. I should have worn my other outfit. <laughs> oh, my God. Let me see those teeth. Let me see those teeth. Okay. And now, oh. is he someone that's your type? Yeah. I like the earrings a lot. And the ears are, I don't know, you just look really, like, 
gothic in a sense almost i don't know i like it a lot thanks (laughs) yeah cool let's go on over here your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon uh my name is johnny and i'm 34. um the reason i popped my balloon is because you said no smoking of any kind and that's what i do all day I ain't gonna lie. She's a legal lawyer type. You know, I mean, I'm into fitness and health. You know, everything, every other ha- habit I have is healthy uh, outside of that. But, you know, I need that. Yeah, yeah. You know. So, I mean, uh, also, you said you were a legal specialist. Mm, I, I don't mean, know what that means. But it could be good or bad. Was, <laughs> it's it's good. More coordinator-wise. Let's put it that way. I should have just said that. But, yeah. Okay. I mean, yeah. But, yeah. Mainly for the smoking. But okay. You're very beautiful. I yeah. do like the glasses. They fit you well. Can't see without them. <laughs> <laughs> and now is he someone that's your type? Yeah. Yeah. I, I definitely think you're yeah, my type, too. Um, it's Myrtle Urkel I think of you're very attractive 2024. And I like what you're wearing. Um, and I like the Arizona logo. I'm an Arizona native, so I got to represent. I feel like it. I've been out, out here for long enough, so I feel like a native at this point. So, <laughs> okay. you know, I have to represent. Okay. So. But don't tell me you're but, used I mean, to I'm the from, heat. Cause nah, I'm from, from the Midwest. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go on over here. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. What's up? I'm Justin. I'm 34. I popped my balloon because um, obviously I don't think like you would like me. I smoke a lot of weed. I got a weed pendant on me right now. Even though I'm like a full time athlete, uh, a lot of people, you know, misconstrue the, the, the substance and the necessary like goals and ambitions to get where we need to get. But yeah. anyway, other than that, you're a very beautiful woman, chocolate, gorgeous. I love the glasses. You got white teeth. You like a bombshell for me. Uh, if you didn't have a negative for me, then I'd be all positive for you. Okay. Other than that, um, again, I do have one thing to say. Come on, I man. just feel like you probably underdressed yourself. I did. Because um, <laughs> you do look like a Black Wednesday from uh, yeah. Adam's family. Yeah. But that's attractive to me, yeah. you know what I'm saying? We can role play I, all day. You know, uh, no, you're not wrong. No, like yeah. I'm actually like, I'm actually really like in the gothic yeah. style. I was gonna wear like. A, I mean, look, something I don't. I grew up. I'm yeah. a. I, I was born in '89. I don't do the t- definitions and the terms and stuff. Mm-hmm. But I can role play. I can get you know. what I'm saying I can get you excited man, on, and stuff man. like that. Um, if it's a match for you, it's a match for me. You thirsty? But right now, it's a no for me. Yeah. Okay. okay. Is he someone that's your type? Yeah, you're. you're, you're I, I like good banter and like you just seem like you would make me laugh. So yeah. Okay. I would love to make you laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell. Is your balloon? It's pop. It's pop. Okay, it's pop. you had your hands behind your back. <laughs> your name and age. Come on, Gerald Levert. Popping your balloon. Look, army you strong. I'm single from back in the nineties because you're just not my type. Honestly, okay. I'm honestly, I like me. more taller. Yeah, I'm honestly. Yeah. So yeah. shut up, okay. man. Sure. No, yeah. no, but you're very beautiful, though. You know, you're probably Thank just you. not my type. Okay, and now is George someone that's your type? Today, mm. been up I wouldn't say you're not my type. I just, I don't know. I feel like we have to get to know you more. Yeah, same here. You know, but same I here. like the necklace. Thank you. I like what you're wearing. I like the all black. You're a great ski. Yes, match it, match it, And the gold. You're right. Match my glasses. So you're right. It's very nice. See? Yeah. Cool coordinated. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I joined the Old Spice Hair Rescue Crew really to Spy make out. a difference. Bad like around to be guys good like this with flat drop. Hello, okay, so we do have two balloons left on top. Go ahead and ask these guys a question just to help us narrow it down, see who's more of your match. Um, what do you do for work? Okay, name and age, and what do you do for work? Hi, my name is Bassi. I'm 36. I work in construction, and I also um, own a construction business, too. Yes. Okay. Our Same next question. guy, name and age, and what do you do for work? Uh, my name is Kenneth. I'm 35. Uh, my mom and stepfather own a behavioral health company uh, for teens, uh, boys, group homes. So I just kind of like oversee the homes and uh, just offer mentorship and just let the kids know that just because you're in a group home, uh, that don't means you still can't be successful. Love that. Yeah. Yeah. Love that. Okay. Like he got his work shirt on. From Guys, any questions for meet. her? Oh, okay. Asylum shirt. Um, tell me one unique thing about you. And also one bad habit about you. Oh, God. Um, unique thing about me is it's I so actually ugly. refurbish they uh, Victorian. They're um, having the ugly off. 
uh, decor and home furnishings. Okay. Um, I revamped them to either be more functional, so a lot of Victorian pieces are you look at it, not as functional look. as you would like them to be, and I just make them came in more unique, looking I crazy. guess you'd say. Um, I'm really into She'd building, and I'm starting to weld, she so I'm just doing a, a lot of things six. like that. It's She'd one of the unique like things um, on top of <coughs> photography. Really as I say, man, the longer you look at people on the show, they start to look better. Very dark photography. So we can get into that later, but nothing she like probably, crazy. She's probably it's bad just, upon that suit. Um, I like the macabre. She, so. she get eight. All right, now I thought her teeth looked bad, okay. but they don't. Let's go to our next guy. Any questions over here? I got a little gap or something. Uh, yes. Um, what do you do in your free time? Um, I read a lot, mm -mm. and I'm currently studying mm -mm. Um, for my LSAT to get into law school. Mm -hmm. And I kayak. I've been kayaking a lot, and I really love it. Um, and... Uh, what do I not do? <laughs> I'm I, s I'm really starting to explore Arizona. I've sure, been here okay. my whole life, but I'm actually not doing like the best things, have been on this. So. Okay, episode. you went to like herbs and stuff like herbal. No. Um, I have like sage and yeah. crystals and things like okay. that. Okay, uh, it seems like you're yeah. into like vintage. Stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to make connections with her, man. Yeah. I don't know. That's I mean, some thirsty dudes, like My favorite man. paintings are like 16th are century thirsty, Dutch man. still life paintings. Like I'm very okay. Into yeah, that kind I of collect stuff. paintings too. Yeah. Okay, yeah. 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 You don't right, like the show, man. I can't sit here and listen to. Are you okay with that? Um, this is dude she picked, man. No, I I mean, I, I well, she ain't okay talk with. about it a lot of different things. Mm -hmm. It would be nice, but. Are you okay with that? Hold um, on. Any final questions between right. the two of you before we decide if this is a match? I'll just gotta let you know, um, I do have two kids. Mm. Um, okay. 11 and 12 year old. Are you okay with that? Um, oh. No, I, I mean, I think it's just because I'm at a stage where I'm working towards getting to law school and doing different things and I don't know if I would be a good fit for that uh, um so how involved blue, are uh, you in their life there's your me yeah and there so yeah I mean, sorry. there's your me yeah and there like I said they're 11 my son is 11 my daughter's 12. Daughter's 12. so they're okay. older so yeah. yeah gotcha okay I don't think it would be a good match ah. I'm sorry go ahead and pop all right. Well, oh. that is all the balloons un oh. unpopped. But we do thank you so much for yeah, coming Louise out. Let's give it up for the guys. Here. I'll take the mic. Thank oh. you. <laughs> okay, hey, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. <coughs> hey, what are you doing? Hello, welcome in. What's oh. your name? Giovanna. Giovanna. Giovanna, how old are you? 32. And what do you do? I'm an entrepreneur. Okay, and what does that entail? Like, what businesses do you have? I'm in finance. I have a tax office. I ain't even going to put a lot of air in this blue. And now, what are some I ain't going to put no air in this blue. Um, I like to do the Pilates. I like no, you don't. going out for walks. Oh, no. Going out to try a new restaurant. Oh, no, my needle. Um, things like that. Got it. And now, what are some things you look for in a man? I don't know. Um, no. I'm looking for someone traditional. Mm. Um, she got to go. Someone honest. Um, a provider. Okay. No, sir. Um, loyalty things like that okay and now what are some of your deal breakers oh they um, actually built oh my drinking. god mm. um multiple kids she's like a okay. couch cushion so we did get look at um, you thirsty i want that yeah. going over there and see why they ended up popping okay. look at that hell okay let's start look with Auntie. your name and age Auntie and why you ended up popping your balloon all right, my name is Bassi. I'm well, 36. To I'm gonna be 37 in a couple of days. Yeah, oh my so, God. Yeah. The reason why I popped the balloon because I don't know um, you do look good. I like what you're wearing. Um, no, no, the no. only issue is just I don't feel any chemistry. Yeah, Ugh. that's just it. Ugh. But you do look good though. Thank you. Yeah. And she got braces. Or something? And now is he someone that's your type? She's like Bonita. No. Her name Bonita. No. Okay. And why not? Ugh. Um, height mainly. Okay. That might be an issue. She's Too like, short? She's like an office chair. Height. What? I'm six foot. Oh. What? How tall are you? Five feet. But in these heels, I feel like I'm giving a little bit taller. No. <laughs> I'm six foot. You know that, right? <coughs> yeah, I'm six foot. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's go to our next pop okay. balloon. <laughs> your name and age and why mm -hmm. you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Paul. I'm 39. How many kids you got? I pop my balloon because usually somebody at least with entrepreneur is just not really my thing. Um, I think otherwise you're pretty well put together. Yeah. Um, it's a little shallow to go based on height because that's a static thing that mm -hmm. we can't dynamically Last change. Last call for alcohol. So somebody take reason I popped the balloon. Thank you. Okay. And now is she, he someone that's your type? 
No. Okay. She had numbers not? in the country I'm somewhere. Aesthetically, because that's the only thing I have to go on. Mm. Yeah, them damn okay. leather. Thank you. And then we did get one over here as well. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Hell no. All right, I'm Justin. I'm 34. I didn't want to pop my balloon, but, mm. you know, aesthetically, she's pleasing for sure. Mm. Um, I like the pigeon toe stance. I like the dress that she got <laughs> going on. I like the braces, you fixing, correcting, whatever you got going on. Um, I like the hair, the braids, your eyebrows. Everything about you is a beautiful black woman speaks out. Um, I believe you might have said something that made me pop my balloon. Um, but I can't remember because I have ADD as an adult, you know what I'm saying? But um, other than that, you definitely are uh, well spoken. You definitely are pleasant to what the eye. What is this nigga always talking? Um, and just besides you saying something that would mean that I'm not your fit, that's why I pop out and Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> now, is he someone that's your type? No. Okay. Well, yeah. just his height. I mean, like, if he was to approach me on the street, I would just. He yeah. Would. All right. So we do still have three balloons left unpopped. Did you have a question to ask the guys to go ahead and help you narrow it down? Yes. Okay. Um, do any of you have kids? Oh, all three of them. All three of you have kids? Mm -hmm. Okay. Are kids a deal breaker for you? Um, to a certain extent. Okay. How many kids do you guys have? Okay. Let's start with our first guy over okay. here. Your name and age and how many kids do you have? Uh, my name is Kenneth. Uh, I have Uno. One. Uno. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Our next guy. Name and age, and how many kids do you have? My name is Johnny, 34. I have one son. Okay. Your name and age, and how many kids do you have? My name is George. I'm 35. I have two. I got okay. Two. Thank you. Okay. All right. Any other questions? No. No? Okay. So <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and actually have you pop one of these guys' balloons. What's up, hustlers? I am Robin at Stone. Welcome to the party, baby. We are here to take care of ourselves and each other. Calling today's workout. Your brain is like that. Sorry if I can borrow it's your like pick. Mountain lion or Billy Goat. <laughs> there you go. And go ahead and pop one of these guys' balloons. Just one. Just yeah. One. Come on, just one. Unless you have more that no. you want to pop. Okay. <laughs> I don't. Child bearing hips. <laughs> Slope flatheads. So why do we end up popping his? Um, it's. The multiple kids for me. I mean, you got Thank respect. You. I understand. Thank you. I love them so. <laughs> That's how that matters. Yeah. I mean, you got. So why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? She's very pretty. I was very interested to see what she had had to say. So, but she popped it. So, <laughs> it's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay, guys. Any questions for our beautiful lady? Uh, yeah, I have a question. Um, so. Uh, All right. Uh, I think it's the last like one coming up in next. In terms of like your leisure time. Um, I like going out to eat, of course. So I like shopping. I spend a lot of time out in nature. I like hiking. Come on. Uh, do Pilates. Go on you walking. Don't do no Pilates. Time to pop someone's balloon. <laughs> <laughs> I really, if I had to choose between those two, then I would have chose him. I feel like he asks a lot of questions more. Um... But that's the only reason why I would pop yours. Okay. I had to make a decision. Well, all, <laughs> <laughs> all right. So let me bring you on up. Let's come on up here. Let's come on up. Yeah, man. Okay, y'all. Any no final jumper. questions before we determine if this is a match? I'm going to get uh, one of my yeah. new Did you church. get vaccinated? Yes. Okay. I didn't, but that's still cool. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Match. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. I have another question. Do you plan on having more children? Do you want more children? Uh, in the future, yeah, I do. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right, y'all. So is it a yes for you for her? I would say yes. Okay. And is it a yes for you for him? Yes. We got a match. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go ahead and take this mic. Yeah, you and you guys can going need. up. <laughs> Let's make some noise for them, y'all. Come on. Man, 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 man. <laughs> okay. What Let's go ahead and bring out our next into single a, a lady. Thug. The one in the uh, black shirt, he turned into a thug at the air time. Welcome in. What's your name? Uh -huh. I'm Shar. Shar, how old are you? I'm 30. 30, and what do you do? <laughs> I'm a doctor. Okay, nice. Yeah, two doctors okay. What do some things like to do for fun? Um, I love dancing. Um, I've been a salsa dancer for face. six years. Oh, yeah, I also yeah. love traveling. 
um, oh, going out, face. going on adventures, all of that stuff. Nice. Yes. Yes, it is. Uh, what are some things you look for in a man? She got a beak. Oh, um, someone that's kind, a gentleman, marriage-minded, um, likes to have fun as well, uh, has a growth mindset, ambitious, all of that. Got it. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? <laughs> Um, I would say any drugs or if you smoke a lot, like every day type oh, of thing. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. <laughs> all right. So we do smoke have every day. all the balloons still unpopped. Okay. Oh. Not anymore. We do okay. have one that popped. <laughs> Let's go on over here and sure. ask him why he ended up wow. popping. Your name and age and why you popped your balloon. All right. My name is Bassi. I'm 36. Oh, you did look good, by the way. Um, the you reason don't. why I popped it is because... Somebody else told me that I'm, I'm like too short, locks. so I figure you're taller than me, so I probably won't be your type, so. Yeah. But is she your type? She like a model. She look all right. Okay. Yeah, but she I mean, I just chin. had to pop, yeah. She okay. Oh. Is he someone that's your She's type? She's like Lil Wayne from the side. Um, I mean, she I feel like you popped your balloon prematurely because, I mean, I'm wearing heels, so I don't know what your what height what? limit is. I'm six foot. It just, uh, I don't know. Yeah. So is she too tall for you? Is that what you're saying? You uh, scared. I, mean, I just had to pop it because I figured she was, she was gonna say that I'm like I'm like too short for her. So I know. So yeah. I mean, I didn't say height was a deal breaker, but okay. that's fine. That's fine. Okay. 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 Nice. You do look good though, by the way. Yeah. You Thank you. Good. Thank you. All right. So we do have four guys still left here. Did you have a okay. question to ask these guys to kind of help you narrow it down? Um. Sure. I guess I'll ask. Um, what do you do, and, and what do you like brown, most about what you do? Great Timberlands. Mm, all right, let's go on over here. Your name and age, and the answer to your question. My name is Paul. I'm 39 years old. Like I'm an ICU either. vascular access nurse. Um, I enjoy doing what I do because it's about helping people and uh -oh, yeah, you know giving them right a better there. experience considering they're sick and in the you're hospital. Doctor, so that's that's why I enjoy doing what I do. Okay, great. Thanks. Okay. Next guy. Your name and age, and the answer to your question. Uh, my name is Johnny, 34, and look at, look I do a sexy lot, he is, if man. I pick a career, it's a fitness uh, trainer, that's my passion, mm -hmm. and then oh. that answer the question as well, that's my passion, that's the reason why I like to do what I do. That's why I like, he, he's, that's about, he, he's been my passion since I was a kid, I've been training people since I was five, so. Well, y'all can't see it. this, well, shit, okay. yeah, popper. <laughs> Name and age and the answer to your question. I'm Justin Jacobs. My camera, uh, hey. The answer to your question is... Uh, I'm very passionate about pretty much everything I do. Um, whatever I choose to do at the moment is what I'm going to be she passionate like a, about. She like a shark. Uh, I have a pretty open career as far as uh, I'm an entrepreneur zoom, zoom. and I'm a zoom, successful zoom, zoom, entrepreneur. Zoom, zoom, so I just let that do what it does. And then as far as my hobbies she like a shark. and you know, goal or career aspirations outside of that, I'll let them grow. Um, I do like to fly. I'm into mouth, aviation. Shorty. So, and she got with no that being said, she, uh, she the, the thing I like about me being shirt. into aviation is that I have a large family. So, at Thick any given pump. moment, once I'm completely where I want Thick to be, though. as far as private, nice, private license or she look like you know, a shark. having she look a, like a jet license evil. and stuff like she that, the, I can travel around Duke, my family. I can introduce them to new ideas, new surroundings and environments. That's what I look forward to. Man, to come on, I'm man. Right Quit telling us your life, life story. So, Pop his balloon, yeah. man. I'm looking for somebody who can seamless. We're going to go ahead and get a balloon pop. So let me hand you a pic. <coughs> I'll give you that. <coughs> and just kind of based off of the responses, you know, how they look, whatever it may be, I'm going to go ahead and have you pop one balloon. Okay, just one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just one. Well, it's hard. Uh, I'll pop yours. I'm sorry. Okay, so why did we end up popping his? Um, just your response is a little vague. Oh, okay. Um, oh. I would love to learn more okay. about That's uncle. what you did. That nigga sit at the grill well. and barbecue and for you, boy. My type of guy, but you no, look his very ribs nice. Is, thank so. you, thank you, thank you. You got some yeah. good ribs. Had to pop I one. So. I got you. I got you. <laughs> I know. I know you need one. Respect. Respect. <laughs> Respect. So, why did you have your balloon unpopped? She's very pretty. I was very interested to see what she had to say. Um, I couldn't go to more detail because I can want to do it off camera. So I get it too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I was I kinda, like, I don't you know want to be very vague. Yeah, 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 I didn't want to be yeah. too too detailed. But yeah. I bet he get with me. I bet he get hold. He he, okay. he talk. Thank you. He 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 talking for the show. At Cox Mobile, we know there's a better way to nigga. save. That's why we run on the. Okay, I'm gonna have you ask the guys get another that nigga question. Some I bet that nigga be t acting a fool, cutting um, up. Um, shoot. 
what are you looking for in a woman? Okay, right over here. Yeah, I'm looking for somebody that's progressed. I can't do these <laughs> questions. How yeah. many? We're gonna go ahead and pop one of them. Come out. Of I can't yeah. do these. what? I mean, what don't, don't. What's your hours? Is it sixty? Like he said, it's a little under sixty. Uh, so I need yeah. you to pick this nigga. <laughs> All right, well, head on back over there. Oh. Oh, well, that is all the balloons popped, but thank okay. you so much for coming on. Let's well, go ahead and give it up for her. For? Yeah, Take this way. A lot of their time, so that's mm -hmm. that's why I got a pop. Oh. Sorry. Oh. Well, well. You didn't even ask me about I mean, I okay. work with doctors. All right, any final questions between the two of you? Um, my big thing is work hours. I mean, I okay. work with doctors. Yeah. And I know anesthesiologists specifically work at least 60 hours, and it kind of consumes a lot of their time, so that's mm -hmm. that's why I got a pop. Oh. Yeah. You didn't even ask me my hours, though. <laughs> What's your hours? Is it 60, like you said? It's a little under 60. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, well, head on back over there. Oh, well, that is all the balloons popped, yeah. but thank you hey. so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for her. Yeah, thank Take this you. Okay. Thank you. It goes to show you, man. That's a good dude right there, man. It's a good dude right there. <clears throat> she had body. She was bad. She a doctor. But that man, he's like, yo, I need some time, too. You see? He work in that field. She might make more paper than him. He ain't seem to be worried about that. <clears throat> she taller than him. He ain't seem to be worried about that. He was like, okay. You make more paper than me, ain't you taller? You bad. But I need your time, baby. And that's what it was, man. He was like, so I'm I'm, 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 I'm going to bow out gracefully. He won to lose. So big shout out to homie, man, for doing that, yo. Um, This episode was, uh, it was all right, man. The choices of the dudes, speaking for the female perspective, I'm some raggedy, <laughs> some raggedy looking dudes, man. <clears throat> They wasn't their best. The females, they was all right. They didn't have no just bleh, the straight up pops um, off gates, but um, it was all right, man. This episode, they they um, mm -hmm. it was all right, man. I like I like judging people, talking about people, man. So that's what I do, man. But any time other than that, man, y'all can check me out and anything I got on this channel, man. Look through the videos i do whatever whatever or catch me live on friday nights right here on the channel man i go live talking about everything in the world that's going on so come through and holler at me man hit that like button the comment button the share button the subscribe button the notification bell <clears throat> all them good buttons you gotta hit to get this pimp that i'm putting out when i put it out and like i said i'll let you boy every friday night right here on this channel talk that talk get on news and opinions This is a dangerous group that groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time, but I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there. <laughs>